What if I told you a football and a box are very much the same thing? Sure, they may not look so at first glance, however, in the eyes of topologists, indeed, they are both the same thing. That's where topology comes in. Topology is a relatively new branch in mathematics that deals with the preservation of spatial properties of an object and a smooth deformation. Smooth meaning there is no tearing or stitching of the object's surface. Let's go back in history where topology was first discovered. In 1746, a Swiss mathematician by the name of, you guessed it, Leonard Euler, he published a paper for the solution to the historically famous Seven Bridges of Konigsberg problem. The problem was to devise a path through the city of Konigsberg crossing all seven bridges in one journey. Feel free to pause the video and try crossing all the bridges yourself. Assuming you had a crack at it, here's Euler's solution. Euler's analysis of the problem showed that it is impossible to cross all seven bridges once in a single journey. Here, we see that walking through the city, we soon come to a dead end where it is impossible to cross the last bridge. The only way that it's possible to do so is to build a bridge that connects the two lands together where we stopped, and only then shall it be possible to cross the last bridge. This groundbreaking achievement led to the development of topology. As we have noticed, Euler's solutions didn't take into account any measurements at all. All was considered was how the bridges were connected. This is what differentiates geometry from topology, where topology is a qualitative field and geometry is a quantitative field. With that being said, any configurations of lands connected by bridges similar to those of Konigsberg city, it will always be impossible to make a complete journey around the city unless the engineers took into account Euler's solution. So now, how does Euler answer our question about a football and a box being the same, even if he had great influence over the development of topology? Later on, in the year 1750, Euler developed this equation called the Euler characteristic in his name. Let's say we had a rubber box instead of a cardboard box. If I were to inflate it with air, it would start to resemble the looks of a sphere, which is the shape of a football of course. To prove this, let's use Euler's formula, where we see that the cardboard box has 4 vertices, 6 faces and 12 edges. This is also true for the inflated box. The only visual difference is that the faces and edges are curved due to the deformation. But this deformation is considered smooth because there was no tearing or stitching of the box surface. So we get the Euler characteristic is the same for both a box and a football, hence they are identical. In topological terms, they are homeomorphic. As a bonus for watching till the end of this video, in topology there is a common joke where a topologist can tell the difference between a coffee mug and a donut. This simply means that the coffee mug can be deformed continuously into the donut and vice versa. 